Welcome to Safety Hearts and Minds, videos to help you energize safety culture, build teamwork, and get employee buy-in. You know, when a company's going through a tough time in safety performance, the first inclination seems to be throwing more safety at their people, to double down on rules enforcement, step up more inspections, to have more meetings. The logical thinking is that if safety's the problem, then more safety must be the answer. But it just isn't so. More safety isn't the answer to the safety problem because safety isn't the problem. Engagement is the problem. Gallup polling for the last 10 years has pegged the disengagement rate of employees at about 70%. That means 7 out of 10 employees are not actively engaged in doing their work. So, what makes you think that if 7 out of 10 of your employees are not actively engaged in their work, that they're suddenly going to engage in safely doing the work they're not actually engaged in? Look, if you want to fix safety performance, you have to fix the engagement problem first. And this is where most get lost. How do you fix the engagement problem? Well, you start with the simple premise that people give more attention to the things that they get more appreciation from. Look, if you feel unappreciated in anything you do, work, volunteering, helping a family member, if they don't appreciate your contribution, you don't do it for long. And if you do continue to do it, your heart's not in it, and you end up giving just enough to appease them. No one likes to go to work or to give their best effort if no one appreciates it. Safety fits in there too. People won't give their full effort to safety if no one seems to appreciate the effort. They'll give just enough to stay out of the doghouse, but not much more than that. Look, if you appreciate your people, they'll appreciate you and will give you their attention because you gave your attention to them. Now, don't think about walking around slapping everyone on the back, spitting out the same good job to everyone. They're not toddlers using a potty for the first time. Appreciation needs to be felt. And if you don't appreciate your people, you'll never appreciate their effort. So connect with them. Tell them how important they are to the team, that the work is easier because they're there. But you'd better feel it or you're going to come off as patronizing. If you want them to engage in safety, it works better when you engage in appreciating them.